Uh, it's what Jack and I know, but small follow-up for in, in the last session we were doing the railroad side and that was divided, what's that? This time we're doing the institute side of things. Well, we do an institute to get this back, so we have to continue working for father. He's going to have to speak to. Sounds like those raiders have really been getting extra dressed. Are there many more of these questions? Interesting. Any additional pain? Looks like he's just a bear. I feel quite well. Interesting. I'm not scared of the surface. I see. You're sticking to the regimen we agreed upon? Yes, Doctor. I'm taking all my little pills. You wanted to see me? I understand mass fusion was a success, despite interference from the Brotherhood of Steel. The job is done. That's what matters. For the moment, yes. The Brotherhood's intervention must be placed in a larger context, however, given their pension for hoarding technology. Future conflict with them is guaranteed. We are, after all, keepers of the most advanced technology in the Commonwealth, if not beyond. It also cannot go unnoticed that there were concerns within the Institute about your allegiances. I, of course, never doubted your commitment to our cause. But by directly confronting the Brotherhood, I think you've put some others at ease. I'm proud of you, regardless. The Brotherhood is an issue for the future, and we must focus on the present. And look at me, rambling on like the old man I am. I'm wasting time. You're needed elsewhere at once. Whatever it is, I can take care of it. I certainly hope so. This situation, I'm afraid, is something of your creation, however unintentional. What do you mean by that? What's happened? Well, while you were assisting Dr. Fillmore, a second team was sent out to invite someone from the Commonwealth to join the Institute. Apparently, there was some miscommunication, and this individual called for help, which arrived in the form of your minute. My understanding is that no shots have been fired. I would like it to stay that way. I need you to go there and speak to your Minutemen gathered outside. Insist that they stand down at once. Dr. Thompson is on site, and he will be your primary contact. I know you can resolve this situation, but it is of paramount importance that this special individual be brought to the Institute immediately. They'll listen to me. I'll figure something out. You can consider this handled. Believe me, I already do. Right, where do we have to head? There. Grey Garden. Oh, we'll be... Yeah? What's going on here? You're an unexpected surprise. We could use the backup. These Institute bastards aren't getting away. They'll have to go through us to get out of there. We don't know quite what we're up against, but it's good you're here to help. Uh, how did you hear about this? I'm not sure you know what's going on here. This situation is... complicated. Oh, I know exactly what's going on. These assholes think they can kidnap whoever they want, whenever they want. Well, not today. Not while we're here. So, how do you want to play this? We thought about trying to lure them out here, since it'd be easier to kill them. But then we realized we probably ought to storm the place, to make sure they can't disappear on us. That makes sense, right? So, you want to lead the charge? No one is going to do anything. 
Tell your men to stand down. I don't... Are you kidding me? If we don't do something now, they're gonna take that poor guy wherever it is they go. And we'll have failed. Again. Are you gonna order the attack or not? This whole thing is just a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding? Can't wait to hear this. Explain to me how this is a misunderstanding. I know for a fact they won't hurt that man. And if you get in the way, I'm gonna have to take you down. Whoa, whoa, look. I'm not trying to get everyone here killed, okay? No. Oh, we won't act. He's with me. But if they kidnap that guy, it's on your head. You should be on me. Go in. In we go. Oh, thank God you're here. I was starting to worry we might not make it out of this mess. Everything's taken care of. You're safe. Good. Good. It was bad enough that Wallace started giving us trouble. But then he called in those savages. The Minutemen were only doing what they felt was right. Well, from here it looked like they were out for blood. And if you hadn't arrived, I think they might have gotten it. Can we just get on with this, please? I know he's potentially important to Phase 3 and all, but I'm not sure it's worth putting ourselves in harm's way. If he's really important to the Institute, then it's worth it. You're right, I suppose. I know they've been keeping an eye on him for years. Not sure how they originally found him, but probably don't want to know. But once they realized how smart he was and what an asset he could be for Phase 3, they watched pretty closely. I think they even fed him scientific material from time to time to see how good he was, you know, testing him to see if he was Institute material. Let's just get Wallace and get out of here. No argument from me. Let's go. Right. There's just, well, there's a slight problem with that. He doesn't want to go with us. I was thinking, maybe you could try and talk to him. No problem. I'm sure I can get him to see reason. I hope so. We really need him. Where is he? In here. Busted. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? Don't be ridiculous. Of course I'm not a robot. That's exactly what a robot would say. I've heard all the stories. I know exactly what happens to people when the Institute shows up. Well, it's not happening to me. Hey, just calm down, okay? I just want to talk to you. Fine, fine. What do you want from me? The Institute needs your help, Mr. Wallace. It's as simple as that. My help? With... with what? The Institute has an engineering problem that your scientific expertise could help solve. In exchange for helping us out, you'd be granted access to the most advanced research facility imaginable. Whatever research you wanted to perform, anything, it's possible there. I promise. You'd be safe and secure in a way that's completely impossible anywhere else. You'd be helping us create a better world. That... That sounds good. Okay, fine. I'll go. I'm looking forward to working for you, future director. <sighs> okay. I think we've got this under control now. Thanks. I mean, thanks for the assist. Hey, I'm here to help. You're welcome. I really mean it. I owe you one. I'll see you back in the Institute. 
Right, that's pinned. Now what do we have to do? Powering up. I think that's it, now we go back to the railroad. Someone's supposed to send me a message about the railroad. If you ask me, this ridiculous plot by Higgs and Loken is just a stunt to get attention. Hey there. I knew Dr. Higgs was dissatisfied, but I didn't think he would go this far. Hmm. What's it? What's it called? That quest? Underground undiscovered. Let's have a look. Oh, let me cover. Oh, underground under. Oh, my God. Here we go. Right, so it's after this quest. There you are. I cannot express how pleased I am. Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his surroundings. Yet he's already pointed out several inefficiencies in our methods. With his help, Phase 3 will be ready in no time. And it's all thanks to you. I'm proud to help the Institute. Here's hoping it all pays off. At this point, there is no doubt. It will succeed, and very shortly. There is one more part for you to play. And I think you might enjoy it. It is time to announce our presence to the Commonwealth. To request that they do not interfere with our plans. You should be the one to do it. That's a good idea. Hopefully we can prevent violence and save some lives. Yes, that is one goal. And if you are to be the new director of the Institute, you should be the one to do it. We've prepared some remarks for you to record. Once you're finished, we'll bring...